Today because it's a very uneventful day I mean in a way <laughs> okay <laughs> let me explain so first of all we're planning for, let me turn my lights on oh my gosh I made a terrible mistake what am I doing so first of all we we're planning a trip right um, and then I was going to request my days off and the same day or the day before I was, the night before I was going to request um, two days off of work like a Friday and a Monday off of work I got a letter in the mail saying that I had jury duty on that Friday or I may have jury duty that Friday and I was like, well, this is going to mess up all my plans, so I was talking to my supervisor. I'm like, how do I go about doing this? Because I'm not going to use my vacation time to do jury duty. And they said to call the night before, like, the office said to, oh my gosh, I made a big mistake. And the office said to call the night before to see if they are still going through with jury duty. So I was pondering whether or not I should do jury duty if it's still there or just go on vacation just skip the jury duty because this is the first time i've ever been summoned for it so i'm sure i'd be okay um because i didn't want to confuse like my um oh man it's a really bad accident no because i didn't want to confuse like my jury duty time and my vacation time or whatever last minute i decided i'll just go on vacation because we really need a vacation we were going to probably do camping or we were going to go to the keys the florida keys well god apparently does not want us to go on vacation because after we settled on the decision that we were going to go out of town then we find out that we were going to get hit with a tropical depression that was it was um a hur it was a hurricane it hit mexico hurricane agatha and it crossed over and it became a smaller storm and then apparently it turned to a depression um so we were thinking we're still gonna go camping and we're just gonna go up north because it's more north of where we are but pretty much the depression is going to be taking over the whole state of florida for mo most of florida so i didn't want to risk it also we'd be driving in it the day to get to where we need to get to so we were like, let's just stay home. Basically, I requested days off of work so we could get hit with a tropical depression that is now turned into a possible tropical storm. They said it wasn't gonna start raining till like two o'clock in the afternoon. So I was like, let me just take these orders, these orders sitting here on the seat. Let's just take the orders to the post office and then I can just do a quick run to the thrift store since I probably won't be able to go tomorrow because the brunt of the storm is going to be hitting Saturday morning. And it was drizzling and everything and as soon as I get in the car and I start driving, this happens. Now it was just a really bad accident and everybody, it doesn't even look that bad on camera than it really is in person. but. Everyone's driving like 20 miles an hour and I'm starting to regret my decision. I'm probably, I probably should not be driving out in this weather. But I have a thrifting addiction and I'm not low on inventory, but if I don't get stuff, I will eventually become low on inventory later on in the week. Does that make sense? I am just pulling up to the post office now. I don't even know how I'm gonna get in there. I hope I have my thrifting bag in here. Uh oh. It's calling me. But yeah, that's, that's the update. I'm pulling up to the, I was gonna say the airport. 
I'm pulling up to the post office and I don't know how I'm gonna bring all my stuff in there with my umbrella and everything. I can barely see two feet in front of me. It's just a mess, it's just a mess. I probably did not make the best decision today. <laughs> and the keys all the way up to Palm Bay and Melbourne. You can see the areas here, all of Florida, just about. This in the yellow. What you guys should expect is winds from 37, excuse me, 39 to 57, 39 to 57 miles per hour. It's rough out there. I got the double chin. <laughs> What's well, goodie perps? Happy Saturday. It is exactly a day later, and the weather is still disgusting. And we're going to make an attempt to run away from it. Is they were trying to make me feel better talking about it's not that bad, but it is. It's bad. It's been like this for 24 hours now. It is depressing. It is sad. We're not getting wind, but we have a lot of rain. But we're going to try and attempt to run away from this. We're going to head to North Florida. So we're going on a bit of a road trip right now to, to go camping and hope that it's not raining there. It's saying it's not raining, but that storm seems like it's stretched out over the whole Florida Peninsula, but we shall see. But it, it is so gross out here. I am not happy. I, first of all, don't like it when it's raining. Oh boy, this guy's staring at me. Oh, look at the duckies. First, I don't like when it's raining. And second of all, I don't like when it's gloomy. And for a few hours, it's like okay, but like once it's like getting into the whole day mark, like this is ridiculous. Let's see some of the small flooding that we have here on the ground. It's just gross. Everything about it, like just walking on everything, this is yucky and gross. And just, ugh. let me stop complaining. I, I, Started off this vlog to complain. 11.30, just got everything packed into the car, most of the stuff, we just need to get the grill in here and I'm waiting on the pretty boy. I'd be lying if I said that this wasn't completely annoying and irritating right now. Having to get everything into the car and it's all icky and stuff out and the weather seems to actually have gotten worse. Although they said the wet, it would, all the rain and everything should be better and gone by 12 o'clock. It started to feel windy. I see him now. Oh, okay, hold on. Give me a second. Dark side. Pull it and, it was, and then it got caught on the door. And it the what the girl? Disaster. Huh? There's just things everywhere. I don't even know what. <laughs> Why is that so funny? <laughs> Why is that so funny? I just did the joke. That's the way it's gotta be sometimes. Getting cabin fever and shit. For real though. Close that trunk. 
like the, as far as I know, it's more north and central. Looks like Chick fil A. The United lot. States is, yeah. But I heard so much about it, I was like, I'm gonna try it. So that's the burger, or the sandwich, I should say. So we got cheddar. 